Hi there, this is Abhishek here and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to resolve the biggest mystery in the world and this is one of the mysterious questions that many people are searching in the internet. Is that if we upgrade the RAM, does it going to improve the gaming performance? When we should upgrade the RAM? All the questions will be answered in this video so make sure watch it till the end. So for finding the exact solution for this, I have tested multiple games on a laptop with 8GB RAM and I have upgraded the RAM up to 16GB in the same laptop and I Again, I have tested all of those games and I have found a very shocking result and I would like to share with you side by side so that you can find the exact differences with 8GB and 16GB RAM. And here is the exact result with you guys in your screen. With 8GB RAM at extreme setting and ultra setting, the Forza Horizon 5 game is used to crash a lot but when I have upgraded the RAM to 16GB, the game run is smoothly extreme at 21fps and ultra at 33fps but at high settings, even at 8GB RAM and 16GB RAM, the game runs at the same FPS that is 72 FPS. Then I have tested Spider-Man Miles Morales. Very high setting and high setting game used to crash on 8GB RAM. But once I have upgraded the RAM to 16GB, the game run is smoothly at 28 FPS and at high settings 33 FPS. But in the same time, at lowest settings, even at 8GB and 16GB, I was getting 40 FPS only. Next one I have tested Stray and in Stray at 8GB and 16GB, at maximum settings I was getting 62 FPS that is same FPS again even at days gone I have tested at 8 GB and 16 GB RAM side by side here is your result and even here also I am getting almost same result that is around 52 to 55 FPS I have also tested a game such as Gotham Knight that is one of the latest game and it consumes a huge amount of RAM so while testing this game I have found a result such as at highest settings at 8 GB RAM there is only 28 FPS but once I have upgraded the RAM I have found a very shocking result 45 fps next i have tested on gta 5 at maximum settings i was getting average 72 fps but once i have upgraded the ram to 16 gb very easily i was able to play the game at around 91 fps next game i have tested a plague tale requiem that is a high consuming ram available in the market but at all the settings even at 8 gb ram and at 16 gb ram i was getting almost the same fps means at lowest settings i was able to get very easily around 28 fps after doing lots of tests and research, I have found one thing that the game that's minimum requirement is 16 GB. On that case, if you upgrade the RAM, you will get definitely a huge difference. But the game that runs very smoothly at 8 GB of RAM, if you upgrade the RAM on that time, I don't think on those games you will get a very huge difference. For example, you have found the same results such as straight days gone. The results are almost same with 8 GB RAM and 16 GB RAM. Now the question is how do you identify when you should upgrade the RAM. So the application that I used to use that is called Afterburner. You can download it. It is absolutely free. So while playing game, it will show you how much RAM it is consuming. For example, if your RAM is consuming more than 70%, on that case, definitely you should upgrade the RAM and definitely you will get a better performance as well. But if the game is consuming less than 70%, I don't think it is the right time to upgrade the RAM. Means if you upgrade the RAM, even you can't get any huge differences between low RAM or high RAM. And one more thing, like while doing video editing, I don't think 8GB RAM is enough because timeline get freeze a lot. So if you're doing video editing in applications such as Premiere Pro or DaVinci, on that case, definitely you must have at least 16GB of RAM. All right, guys, this is all about today. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you really like the video, at least hit the like button. And if you're new here, do subscribe it and also hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching.